Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Yesterday we lost one of our on the way to National Park and we went to Glen uh, Jilan TP for 26 kilometers further up and we later we decided we are moving in a wrong direction. It's not a 608, it's something else. But unfortunately it's a 608, we have been moved with 26, 26 kilometers further right away. And we come back and we, we stayed here, we asked the police to help us to show some way to how to go to National Park. <coughs> but unfortunately we couldn't get any help from them. And we came here, Shahzad Hussain, Shahzad Rasul Bhai advised us to camp in this park and he is preparing for the breakfast for this morning on Saturday morning. So, <laughs> 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 Hamari is the one as you can see the milk, the ba, and my favorite. As you can see the tuna, as you can see the uh, kira is there. But please don't forget. Cucumber, some kalish, yeah. then there is something in like olive oil. This is the orange juice from Australian summit time, summer yeah, time, tropical time. fruit. Uh, this is our 12 uh, liter water water did tank. You, did you pick the teas? Yeah, this is, I don't know. This is the sugar and everything. This is Naim Khan. Yeah. And this is the tent that helped us to stay overnight over the, on the park. And that was really cool in, outside. And the tent has given us very nice support to sleep here. Unfortunately, it's cold inside and it's very hard to sleep. I know that winds are coming in and like, you know, giving us very nice chilling cold. But then it's right. And see, the tent is behind the tent. Everything is close to the tent. Look at how close it is. And see, it's a beautiful place. Or Abhi Navid Naim by ten kukhar raha hai. I mean, he's just Achha, taking of the tent. Le, tent I'll just show the inside of the tent now, where you have spent the night. This is the inside of the tent because it's a little bit dark, so I cannot go inside much. But I'm still showing you the inside. This is this is the tent. That's it. Everything. That's it. And then this is the door. We came out. So now who are insisting that that and the, the first track was right? Don't this is the uh, outside of the tent, there is a little bit of window there, but it didn't open the window, dare to open the window. And as you can see, it's a park, so you can see a little bit farther. There is a play station for the kids, where the kids can come and play. So we also kids, so we'll go and play there a little bit late, because we need to have some breakfast. Because you're hungry, obviously, you can understand. After giving such a long lecture, we lost our food inside the stomach. Like, you know, <coughs> uh, our tent is here <laughs> and time is busy. He is folding up the cover of the tent and there is Navid Khan, uh, another tent master. He is giving hi to everyone. Just say hello to him. All right. And as you can see our poor car are standing outside from here. So I'll, I'll take you close to the car. As you can see our interior of the car. Let the brothers take the tent out. In the meanwhile, we can have a look around the car. It's not very far. As you can see, I'm getting closer to the car. A little bit shaky because I'm walking. So you can understand. There's a badna pada hoga. There's the badna. As you can see, the badna is here. This is our blanket, sleeping bag, pillows, and everything. This is the car, it's a black color, Toyota. This is the side view of the car. And as I'm opening the door, as you can see me, also in the glass. And this is Naeem's blanket. He should have slept over here, inside the car. And as you can see the steering wheel of the driver. And this is my bag. And as you can see outside is really nice. Over here, this is the road we came through. And yeah, this is the public toilet that we have used last night and today morning for making a go and our other natural calls. And a little bit far you can see the police station. Actually we took help from them, but they were useless. We didn't have much help from them. And as you can see there's a crawl. Obviously you cannot see, it's a bit far. From here I can zoom it in. So Yep, that's pretty much it. As you can see, there are some residents around here.
people are living around this area this is a log private property you can see the fence private fence this is a nice area actually because the sun we cannot see the uh, fog next to the mountain the nice chilling cold outside but it's very fresh air over here you can breathe very nicely and comfortably it's not like city area it's like you know very far out of the city but very close to the nature and as you can see all surrounding us uh, are tea, trees nature in very beautiful green land this is called East Jeep's land area and we'll be going to a snowy mountain snowy river area there's a very huge tidal river we have to go and uh, visit this area and we'll swim inside is the river that's it thank you very much for your time we'll see you again as you can see this is mr naim akhund he is very busy with the fashion on his hand you can see the comb yeah. and you, there's sir. nice sunlight sunlight coming on his face and yeah. you know suraj bhi unka shakal se sharma gaya ki wo itna sundar khoobsurat ladka hai wo you you he still really, mashallah beautiful and smart like yeah. you know hard job for the girls even australian uh, girls are very much uh, fond of him because oh, yeah, they like yeah, to go yeah, with him but yeah I, but I, because of his mashallah guri man and everything he <laughs> is not ready to accept those rubbish thing so you can understand how good Muslim he is, mashallah. May Allah give him more uh, hasana and more strong ima stronger iman so that he can get rid of all those things and Allah give him the nine. Still you believe that the track on which we were before, is that one is right? Well, in that case I'm not really sure but... I'm What's called that uh, old, old Basin Road or whatever? Old Basin Road or Glen Tipi Road because... No, Glen Tipi was, I think the Glen Tipi Road was right. Well, according to the police that he told last night, yeah. Glen Tipi Road was the road that you have to take yeah. all the way to 96 kilometers yeah. so that you can reach our destiny because called Snowy Mountain, Snowy River. La last night, last night, well, it was only, I, I think we only traveled, yeah, maybe well, 26, 26, we were, we were not 30, 30 kilometers. But yeah. we are going, just going, keep on going. But we going, lost going. in a forest. Yeah. That so was in that case. We have decided to come somewhere yeah. where nearby you can have some locality so that you can like you know stay in the tent for yeah. a little while in the night pass like you know let's go finish our night and after that we can have our breakfast and you can start journey again and alhamdulillah we, get, we made a very good decision because we were able to make wudu and do our prayer of isha and salat al fajr <coughs> and alhamdulillah now we are getting ready for our journey again now you can explore more because the daytime sunlight is there there is not much problem because there's nothing to worry about that so if, if, if we even lost the road we can find it out yeah, because we will go on uh, Glen Tipi proper direction the Glen Tipi yeah, road or whatever road it is but we will find out the from the info, local information area to where to go and how to go get there because our brothers the two to go is only the problem yeah. not how to go <laughs> the no. information center will not give how, how to go how to go listen my how to go means i want to say the road we need to find out the directory and the, the direction of the road because as you can see our two organizers are a little bit move naveed yeah. naim naveed and shahad bhai they always talk about we know the direction we know everything <laughs> but in the beginning initial step they have lost the way they went through the and city link which they, they shouldn't have taken 10, 15 kilometer and yeah then they say, and then they realize actually i think we have lost the way <laughs> and that's why we had to have a big argument in the night time actually obviously everyone had to because everyone was a bit upset and, and yeah brother was too much pressurized because of 